So you know what I asked you? What, 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 you've been here the whole, all of the, well, what did you, what, what if, what if you, how has this experience changed you? Let's put it that way. Well, I mean, I guess it has changed my perspective around food, mm-hmm. um, around understanding you know, the background of not just eating, but also understanding what the food does to your food system, to your immune system, um, how it contributes to your body, how it contributes um, mm-hmm. to, you know, um, how you live mm-hmm. daily life, you know, and the environment, uh, you know, and how people connect in a sense, because I mean, there's quite a lot of uh, like procedure from where it's being made to the end user. So it was quite interesting to see or to learn from other people, you know, the importance of each each part of food, especially today, you know, uh, why other people prefer certain type of foods, other people don't prefer certain type of food because of their religious um, ways. So it was quite very interesting journey for me to learn and experience the different taste in food because yeah, it was, it was amazing. How do you think it's going to change you? Yeah, you know, when you when you when you go back to your community, you know, you know, what's going to happen when you go back to your community? You're going to be changed. You know something more about food or whatever. I think one one biggest key or one biggest change is uh, being aware of what I'm eating. Mm. I think that's the most important thing because. I think I'm a person who really loves junk food, and it's all about the taste. Mm. Um, I think also for me, it's always been about the taste. Mm. But I think going forward now, uh, just being aware of uh, where is this food coming from, uh, how has it been made, even just simply just reading um, the, the what's written on the package, you know, just understanding what went, the, the processes of, 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 of um, that went into making this, this food, you know, and the ingredients, most importantly, the nutrition, so I think that's that's one key thing I'll take, you know, just being aware um, of what I'm eating, what I'm putting through my mouth and through my to, to my stomach and just enjoying the taste of it. So yeah. So uh, what's your name? Where do you live? Me. My name is Stefano and uh, I live in Hout Bay. Oh, you um, live in Hout Bay? Yes, the other side of the mountain. Yeah, so. I know where Hout Bay is. <laughs> oh, you got, you got, uh, uh, you got to do something about your beach. I mean, I don't know. The Hout Bay beach. Uh, <laughs> Reputation, Cape Town, you know. I, yeah, yeah. But 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 you you grew up in where did you grow up? So I was born in Johannesburg, and mm-hmm. I moved to Cape Town in 2012. So I've been living in Cape Town since 2012 until now. Mm-hmm. Uh, but interesting is that you know, my parents are from Malawi, so mm-hmm. planning to go to Malawi this year. Really? Yes. So. When, oh, really? Yes. Yes. I yes, want to yes, go yes. to Malawi. Well, we can travel together. Uh, yeah, that way you can give me the insights. You can get me through the you know whatever. <laughs> yeah, right? yeah. Yeah. Okay, Miss Stefano, thank you very much, man. It's a pleasure.